Hey guys, Ronnie Rock Smith here. Okay, so in this video, we're going to talk about the super user. So if you picked up the agency access to sell Flexit, you made a wise choice. If you didn't, you might get another chance at a later date if they decide to offer this feature again in the future. Okay, so here's how this works. Just go to the more drop down box up here and look for super user. Then simply click it. Now, of course, if you didn't purchase this upgrade and if you try to click it, nothing will happen. So this is what the dashboard will look like. So when a customer buys Flexi from you and you get their receipt from whatever checkout service you're using, such as PayPal or Stripe, then you would copy their email address and paste it in here and then put the amount of credits that you sold them and then click the add to user button. After you click the add to user button, the software will automatically send them an email with their login details. Now let's talk a little bit about the credit count allocation here. This will be entirely up to you and how you run this. But as an example, you have 20,000 credits in your account to use when you buy the agency. So 100 credits per user is the minimum amount of credits to give out. So if you create an account with 100 credits and create every account like this, then you could have a total of 200 buyers or accounts created in your agency here. If you later delete an account, your credits for that account does not return. So it's important that you keep your customers happy so they will stay with you for as long as possible. Now, when a customer buys from you, if you set up your buy now buttons on your page, you should offer three packages, Flexi as a standalone, Flexi and OTO1, or Flexi and OTO1 and OTO2, or a variation of the sorts. You could also just make one buy now button with Flexi and all of the upgrades. It's totally up to you on how you want to structure this. However, if you decide to do this, just make sure to double check every receipt that orders from you and make sure that you toggle the proper OTOs in the toggle switches here that they ordered. You also have two more buttons here, one which is the refresh button, and you can use this after you click the toggles on or off to make sure that it updates their account in the system. And then of course you have the trash can icon here which will delete their accounts.